4 episode 13 of Buffy. Last episode was called A New Man and it was a Giles centric episode. Giles met up with Ethan after I was running into Ethan obviously for I'm doing dumb shit again. We realized that during this time he put a spell on Giles um, after talking to him about these like the demons having talk about 313 I think or 313 or 312, 314, one of those numbers. Man, you know, Giles thinking that it has something to do with the army people that he's been running into and Buffy been running into. He was left out of the loop. He had he found out through he found out the Willow and Oz that Buffy knows who is the army people that he's even though he's been looking for them for months. Um, she knows that Ethan is a part of it and also the professor is also a part of the whole you know the whole concept he felt out of the loop and he felt pretty much like like what the fuck like he felt like he, as if he was at a disadvantage and that no one's not telling him anything and he definitely does have a hatred for professor walsh but during that time ethan does like talk to him tell him more about what's happening and in the midst of it josh wakes up the next morning as a fucking demon he cannot speak i mean well he is speaking we hear him but like humans don't understand him except for demons which this is how spike and him had their scenes and spike was able to drive him around remind you that the the group um at the institution or inst whatever the fuck i forgot what the day, day name was for a second they're following just spike and giles but giles essentially does um buffy stabs from the heart and he becomes giles again and buffy and him bond and she realized that it was him based on his eyes so we'll be seeing his dislike brewing um besides that we had willow and tara doing magic again which is very refreshing they were doing a spell about lifting a rose and having it um shed is the rose is petals one by one but the spell did go bad um we don't know if it's due to imbalance but i think it's mostly due to the dark magic happening with you know ethan and shit like that around then we had buffy and riley who were practicing fighting and you know buffy is literally the fucking queen of beating that ass he thought that since he was a man, a macho man, if you will, that he can technically be Buffy and she made him eat his words because she's only going light on him. He was like, go all in. She's like, okay, I'm going all in. Threw his ass to the fucking wall and he was shook. And I think he felt like he can't be her equal or that, you know, she's going to be more superior and that caused a problem to Professor Walsh because she realized that Buffy will not be on her side if Buffy's acting ruthless. I don't know why the fuck Riley made in, insinuated that Buffy was going was on her team because she literally told Giles that she's with she only is with Riley. She didn't marry the um initiation or whatever, you know, that he works for he's with. But to be honest, actually you did because Miss Professor Walsh thinks that you're with them. <laughs> so it actually kind of foreshadowed your words literally not meaning whatever you thought it was. She thinks Buffy's working with her. She and she knows that Riley's really feeling Buffy, so he's not gonna believe anything that she says. And that he's trying to like sugarcoat the fact that she didn't work, she didn't do what they say, which is to leave the demon and continue on. She said, You're not gonna stop me from getting this demon who destroyed Giles, even though it was Giles. Well, we're gonna see how that works. So I don't think Professor Wash is gonna like that. I think this episode was a two-parter, if I don't if I believe so. Lastly, it ends off the episode with Professor Wash going into the cage, which is the monster or demon or whatever the fuck that Ethan did tell Jones, which means that he was telling the truth about that. So let's see what the fuck gonna happen. Let's dive in. I just was in the Discord and Zoe said this is a good episode. She says she thinks we excited. Not I you know watching. magic at the poker table qualifies right. as cheating. I wasn't magic, I was praying. Was you now? Two and three. Damn. This stupid game, all these rules just doing little plastic discs. Okay. Chips. Yeah, for money. What you got in the box is drugs. It's not drugs, is it, Xander? <laughs> not drugs. <laughs> not why will I act like a mom? You. <laughs> three hand poker is not quite the game. Wait, where, where's her Riley? She's out with Riley. You know how it is with a spanking new boyfriend. Right. Yeah, spanking new boyfriend. Right. Yes, we've enjoyed spanking. No, I'm building the cards. Everybody know. Oh, is she practicing with this or shit? Like, what? That is just lucky. I see. <laughs> look around. He's so Still proud. He said, mm. Oh, look at him. He said, I stand by mine. <laughs> 
No one has mentioned anything about the library. I mean, the, the hospital. Somebody had to come to the hospital, which means that Faith could be possibly in the 13. Or someone could be getting her because there's no way she's not going to keep. She's going to keep being. She's going to keep being mentioned and Buffy and, and Angel, but not come back. You do remember about tonight, right? Oh no. Bronze, the gang. Oh. Are you kidding? Okay. I wouldn't be anywhere else. Okay. I miss you guys. She gonna bring Riley though? Riley just walked in. Yeah, he sure did. Cause soon as she looked over, look him. He he he. Uh, damn, she down there. Do you like Twinkie? That's his lunch. Yeah. Oh, that? he's so gonna be punished. Everyone's getting spanked but me. <laughs> what? Not yeah, Zayn getting spanked. I guess you want spank. Um. Um, Riley, but what's wrong with Twinkies? Twinkies good as shit. Like, I want to try Twinkies ice cream. It's very good. Tracking mud all over your mud. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Alright, mate. He put back on his coat. A bit of a fixer upper. He put back on his trenchy coat. Be <laughs> a good woman. Grab it too. Um, 300. Count it. Oh, right. he did yeah. crown. He did get me. Against your nature, but that. Did it catch you? Then maybe a higher purpose. Oh. You made me lose count. Damn, he did. What are you still doing? And your slayerettes. From here on, I want nothing to do with a lot of you. Okay, Not we'll see. Not remain in Sunnydale might make that a little difficult. Speaking of Buffy. Don't have to do this. Don't do what? I know. Something with initiative? Damn. Oh, first of all, I'd probably like, what's she doing in our elevator? But I feel there's no way that Faith you isn't. She isn't. Under care or something, she has you to. Me, but you never said it was or she probably huge. woke up from her coma at some point. Hmm. Well, you actually bad with so, her. Not gonna kiss operation. in 4K. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bring them to a point where they no longer pose a threat. Yeah, no so I've point. seen. Yeah. So you've seen? You should never uh, said that. Discovery Channel. With gorillas and sharks, they. they yeah, you're making things very yeah. What's over there? You can't say you got spike in your crib. Come on, you got spiked the enemy number 17. These weapons. The more advanced are so Look at Buffy. You supposed to be trying to fit in. Don't, don't touch. Don't pick that up. <laughs> Not the camera. $20,000. $20,000. That's really tuition money. Again. I'm hoping she's not Welcome forgetting to, to see her friends tonight. Welcome to her. Welcome to the team. That's the downfall that we did this not need. Entire life. Tara. Well, since June, anyway. Where'd you get it? It, it was my grandma's. I, I want you to have it. Ooh, oh, shut no, up. Tara. Shut up. That, that's really sweet. If you're not doing something, you could come over and we can do something. Do what? Talk to me. Tonight, Tell me more. That sounds really nice, but. Buddy, oh. Riley, you about to be with Tara and do you about to be with a girl? <laughs> oh, not that's the, okay. Not the rejection. Uh, another time. time. Absolutely. It. I'd better get to class. Fuck. Well, um, what if I was, I'll see you later. That's my last okay? straw. Adam! Take your first look at the world. Adam! I know you're gonna make me proud. Do anybody know that you're making a fucking Frankenstein 2.0? Yeah. Alright, I support you. Go uh, somewhere. Oh, well, this was the only one I had on me. Damn! Uh, I told you she was gonna bring up. You could have brought Tara with you. The whole fucking group. Sorry about the latitude. The whole group. Really? The whole group. Never I mean, know. really? Hope you don't mind us hanging along. Where the fuck is this? No, no. On my lap. You know, us. Yeah. Just the Scooby Core, you know. Scooby Core. I could have invited somebody else if I knew it was open for Yeah, Tara. We just Sorry. lost a Tara I in Willowbed. I'm not happy. So who did you want to invite? Don't it. Don't it. Mm. Now you like Riley. No, with Riley. Riley, that's not that's not the thing. The initiative. There's a bunch of stuff about them. We still don't know. I know that. Like what? Like what? Why? Why? Yeah. Why is he okay. doing this? That's all. But I knew she's gonna ask a question. I knew she's gonna ask a question. Buffy. Why exactly can't we damage this poker thing's arms? In my experience, when fighting for your life, body parts get damaged, and better it's bits than mine. I thought about it, but to me, it's gonna look all private, Benjamin. <laughs> don't worry, I patrol in this halter many times. Oh, Buffy, they don't give a shit. They don't Why care. Don't give our attention to Dr. Engelman and save all questions until the Another end. Another Buffy. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, well, uh, it... 
So kind of smile. She was happy. She let her in. She said, "Come in my room. Come in my space." In fact, she liked you quite a bit. Really? Yeah. Because, yeah, because you had to ask her, did you like well, her? Maybe I should get her a present or something. Buffy. Buffy. That is not his I mom. He did not have the kids for ass. Since I don't have your Spike. Spike. Why the go. fuck are you, would you grocery shopping for, Spike? Oh, it's like he knew. He said, you bitch, you think I'm going to let you get home. Oh, he's attended. I'm going to get attended to like. Oh, Alert control. Team. Alert control. Why is this slow motion? Oh. This get this fucking shit out of my face. I'm trying to see the drama. And you want to show me this sex scene. You can get out of here. Are you? I can say I'm not interested. Did this just watch kids have sex? Berry. I should have got my camera well, button on. No. My it's, camera uh, is nasty. It's a gritty texture, isn't it? Maybe you're more of a cherry berry fellow. Ew. How is this our concern? Seeing that you've expressed a desire to have nothing more to do with us. Exactly. Thanks, said that? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. That hurts. Uh, Why should I help you? <laughs> because you do that. Oh, you're no, the no. goody good guys. No. You're the Okay, right back. Her, yes, y'all. Get that Spend money. The rest man. I swear, every time Buffy has entered, every time she does it, they never. Oh, he hey. stayed. What's the matter? You weren't expecting to see me. Yeah, I mean, Angel and Parker definitely. I never know what to expect. Yeah, we don't. Tell you what it was for. Didn't. Didn't. In the military, you learn to follow orders. He working Bye. blind. This clown. The house phone and the beeper. She trying to get to you. She said, I know you're on the right. bed. We have a situation. Where's the camera? Because they all got to see. You're really not one for asking check questions, are you? He's not. And that's what's going to make... That that's, that's what Professor Walsh likes. No questions, do what she says. Buffy's not like that. Which means that Professor Walsh do not like that. Make me proud. Girl! Go to hell. Ugh. Miss Mamas, please. That's why sooner is better. What? You think you're trying to? You think you're gonna try to kill Buffy? It's better. Ugh, it's better, girl. Fuck you. Go to hell. Ow! Casma on the bloody juice hop just get it out of me. Look at the look at the I veins on his shoulders. I'm hoping that's his real veins. Damn veins! Hey. Mmm. Out all night, huh? Mmm. You was too. Hey, Buffy. Hey, Buffy. Hey, Buffy. You too. Yeah. Mmm. Subterrestrial moving through the sewer tunnels just on the north edge of town. Keep making shit up so you can just so can. It's a low level threat, minimal danger. aggression. Wow. You're not crazy about raccoons, huh? We always take precautions. Girl, fuck you. When you get back, we can have a talk. Girl. Good. If she makes it back, because okay. you're trying to set her up. Get back. Mr. Walsh, I'm about to wash you the fuck Am up. Am I supposed to oh, supposed to work here? If she succeeds in spell will ionize the atmosphere around us, thereby disrupting the tracer signal. Let the air be burned. Did it work? The atmosphere ionized? Did it? Did it? <laughs> I bet she is. Is it? She. She. You know, Buffy, you know. Break that fucking gear. It's a setup. It's a setup. Yeah, go ahead, Buffy. I want you to show him. Look her watching this shit. Twisted bitch! That bitch gotta go! That bitch gotta go. She gonna make her think that. Oh, don't, don't. She gonna make her think that. Look at that. Got it. Got it. Damn. Okay, we wanna keep this hostile. You don't know. You don't know, Buffy. Like, right? she been in the trenches. I get that fell faulty gun. Yep. Mm -hmm. I want you to get up and be like, Professor Walls, eat that bitch! Regret to report Fuck her! 17 here. Riley, something's trace. happened. Mm. I, I, I don't know what to say. Look at her. 
It's 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 about Buffy. Look at her. Come She's in. dead, Riley. <laughs> what? I did everything I could to stop her. You did everything you could? So Don't so end it off with her here walking up. She was a very, very special girl. Wait, wait, wait. Something I moving in the back. It's moving in the back. It's moving in the back. Look at her, look at her, look at her. She had some. Mm. Walsh. Oh, That's talking shit. Uh-huh. Wasn't there a raccoon? Me trapped in the sewers with a faulty weapon and two of your pet demons. Talk your shit. Fuck. That's enough to kill me. Exactly. You don't know her. You really don't know what a slayer is. Exactly. Exactly. Bitch. Fuck you. Say you're gonna find out. Oh, fuck out. Fuck this bitch. Fuck this bitch. Fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. What's up? Cause no. Cause no. Cause you about to kill my daughter? Oh, you got me to do it, bitch. You must want the fucking trenches. Oh, look at Riley. It's over for you. Riley. You, you uneven lit. It's over for you. Agent Finn. It's over for you. I order you to stop. It's over for you, bitch. Your lumpy ass lab coat is over for you, bitch. It's safe for you here. No. Oh, she finally knows that you were cutting It's not safe for any of us. Exactly. Who are we? That's a little bitch. Sorry, little Ms. bitch? Washington. Well, you an old bitch. What about it? Threatening me. Crusty bitch. And when she least expects it. Complication, dumbass. You just got killed. Just like, just like that. Just like that. Just like that. Mommy. Mommy. <laughs> Not your son killing you, my precious bitch. Listen, bitch. I'm going to talk about the show. Now, this episode in a minute. We're going to get on her disrespectfully. Professor Walsh, you really played yourself, you stupid ass, crusty, denial, delusional, dumbass bitch. You thought you could destroy a slayer? Bitch, you must not know the slayers go through the fucking trenches. Bitch, these bitches been out here for centuries. You think your dirty old, old ass is going to destroy Buffy? This girl destroyed 200 plus pound men. Fought thousands of fucking vampires and demons since she was fucking 14. That's been 45 years in the making. She's helped prevent the world from ending three plus times. You're gonna put respect on her name, and I'm gonna do it right now. Buffy could destroy your whole fucking group with a blink of a fucking eye. She threw your commander, Riley, to the fucking wall like he was a piece of a fucking dirt like he was a speck of fly like he was a fucking magnet okay maggot she could fling your ass over there too just like your fucking son did you made your son a fucking reptile dillion fucking alien he fucking scooped your heart out instantly and then had mama not only did you play yourself you thought she was gonna play buffy but then you died and now your plan fell because you're not even gonna love to witness it you stupid ass dumb crusty ass bitch you thought you were gonna kill my daughter have her go to fuck to fight two monsters. You don't fucking know what Buffy is. Buffy went through hell and back. L <laughs> literally. You think this little ass is gonna hurt her? This bitch sat here and gave her equipment to watch her fight for her fucking death. Sat there and fucking drink juice like it was a fucking TV star game. You demented, low life, teen obsessed bitch. Not only is doing a, like a fucking public D14 behind people's backs. Died in that bitch. As she deserves. This bitch lost respect from every member. Now this initiative is going to be running buck wild. And I bet you they're going to be ending this soon. This whole time I was like maybe they're enemies. That bitch refreshed to watch his enemies. I knew once Riley started talking about her. It was going to be a problem. She likes order. She wants order. And when Buffy couldn't give her that, when Buffy, Buffy was a questioning her and Riley's authority, she didn't like that. She Riley was so distracted. I mean, he's not distracted, but he cares about her more than he cares about the initiative. And she didn't like that. She wants people to ask no questions. Don't question her authority. Don't question her decisions. Don't question what they're doing. Don't question why they don't kill the monsters. She doesn't want that questioning. Buffy does that. And had even had Riley doing that because he even looked through the fucking door and saw what 314 was. She didn't want that. She wanted to have the power over them too. And she wanted Buffy to be an ally and like a fucking lab rat like Riley and them is who just takes orders and doesn't fucking ask questions. And that's not my fucking daughter. 
my daughter's her own fucking leader she the fucking one that left the fucking slayerville and decided to do her own shit she's fucking almost 20 years old she do not need like a fucking 40 year old woman trying to tell giles how to act like a fucking dad or she need a father figure and get bitch ass trying to send her to her fucking demise excuse me bitch you just demise yourself by your own fucking kid and i should spit on you bitch disrespectful yes yes not even, i didn't spit really but spit on that bitch dust everything throw fucking track bags on this bitch she um the switch yes anyways that episode was fucking good okay this episode had me on my fucking seat towards the end because i was waiting i was waiting to find out what the 14 was was he gonna find out about the initiative and whether or not Riley's going to figure out that and Buffy's going to figure out that Professor Walsh wasn't shit because Giles and them knew then Willow mentioned it to Buffy and then Buffy even was questioning to herself and then she even questioned Riley when he had sex and said do you believe that they're really worth this stuff I knew that this was going to end in a uproar and this is only part one I'm not going to be part two because obviously like she just got she just got killed her son is out do the trenches that means we're finally getting past this initiative dumbass storyline bless up bless up nation i cannot believe that bad that was the bad buff had a lot of bad scenes one from 214 with the bazooka um episode i mean episode one of season four when she had the night i'm you know she's the stake um episode one when she had this when she destroyed lucas and everybody there is so um 214 definitely when her and angel was fighting in the water um the fighting scene from two to season two the mayor um ending finale of season three her and phase fight there's so much bad shit that she's done and i'm so proud to fucking watch her grow in front of my fucking eyes but this shit right here unacceptable this bitch had me have the chills chills bitch i my legs was hopping in my seat chills up my fucking arm i literally was out of the frame i've never felt this fucking hype in my life for a tv show when she talked her shit she talked her shit this woman here buffy and summers this bitch really owns this fucking genre this woman is an icon a blessing on blessing on blessings a fucking queen of this whole fucking thing this girl beat these fucking monsters after being betrayed threw the fucking camera thing down where so the professor can think she's dead beat the monsters up at a disadvantage pick that fucking microphone up and said you thought you were gonna kill me you have to do more than just Dude, it's gonna be enough to kill a slayer you don't need to know more about slaying you know more about us and you think you'll come for me now i'm about to come for you this was the most bad shit i've ever seen in my fucking life the way that you see her in the back of this bitch while she's fucking fake making up theories about trying to help buffy and she just sent her to her fucking demise buffy said ah, ha, 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 ha. listen here bitch i'm gonna hope you and whoever the fuck is around you see this. You don't know what I'm capable of. And I can get anyone, including your fucking clones. And I'm happy she remembered those faces. I think that's why she when they showed it, was like she looked down and saw them fucking monsters. Because them bitches will come right into it. My bitch Buffy, really just that powerful. She really that bitch. And I'm truly fucking proud every day to stand such a fucking amazing woman. She ended Professor Walsh's ass. L listen, Dad, I'm gonna rewatch that shit over and over and over again because that shit is so fucking powerful. What? I don't know. It's something. It must be cracking that scene or something because that shit got me really fucking shaking. Anyways, fuck. I've only got feel like that was kind of weird in our position with the sex scene. I feel like it should have been after the fight. Fuck, this episode was so good. Oh my god, I don't know what to say. Okay. Riley and Buffy, that was a good thing. I'm whole he probably gonna go to find Buffy and probably try to work with her and go against the initiatives. We'll have the scenes in the next episode. We got Spike coming back. 
to the schools obviously he didn't think he's gonna go like he, he played himself he knows he want to work with them and he'll fight the demons and since it's a good time because buffy just said that they cannot trust the initiatives which means that spike can definitely get his revenge on them which i wonder if what's going to happen when riley realizes that spike was with buffy and buffy knew about it because when you know they when buffy kind of slipped up and said something about them being able to kind of cut off the like you know and put pain in people like spike she almost slipped up so i feel like riley might feel some type of way about that we don't know how he's gonna feel but i feel like he's definitely gonna be running into spike because spike is at giles's house and riley's gonna be asking where buffy's at and probably comes by giles house i don't know maybe a guess but he's gonna find out about riley i mean about spike and get mad or something like that because she kept a secret what was over there all night what you was doing over there all night i'm hoping to see some of them do magic maybe I, I i really love them together like i'm i'm more mad that i didn't get more scenes with them but i'm hoping we get more scenes with them in the future um like again i didn't mention faith i hope they do talk about faith because they mentioned it twice they mentioned it in buffy and they mentioned it in angel definitely most recent episode of angel where you know um wesley was talking about how he got fired for basically um losing faith to the mayor in a coma and also buffy so i feel like she's gonna have to be brought back up again like they wouldn't bring it to at this point i was going to realize that they don't bring up shit is not gonna be mentioned or at least solved and you know they brought back wesley and if they brought back wesley who's correlating with wesley faith Anyway, it's all my season 4 episode 32 reaction to Buffy. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for my Buffy reactions. My Patreon will be in the description where you can find reactions to Buffy, Angel, and Taylor Moon in the description. I'm truly going to tell you a like. My Twitter and Discord link in the description where you can find me talking about other fandoms and also talk to me privately about them on Discord. And my Google Drive does have some of my reactions on there that may have been taken from YouTube. Until next time, make sure you be safe. Peace.